I can have anything that I want All my life is like a movie I paint pigs with these songs on Now we making history The Lambo, not no Cherokee We making moves, we overseas I'm on top, you is under me Yeah, uh, yeah I be making moves, yeah I be making Guys, Celtics coach Brad Stevens is known for his play calling LeBron James said he has so many different recalls You've got to keep your head on a swivel He'll run something you've never seen before. But Steven said, honest to God, I've stolen like everything we've ever cut. done from somebody else. Kevin? <laughs> I love his honesty. All right, thank you, DA. And now the opening lineup for Boston. Hayward at small forward with Tatum at the four. Walker and Brown, they're manning the backcourt. And it's Tice in at the five, roaming the paint. Here we go. It'll be the heat off the tip. Eyes on Dragic. Here's Hero. He's covered by Brown. Here's Autobio. A shot off that time, and it's Boston the other way. They'd like to continue the success they had on Friday night here. What a jam! You knew something good was coming, Kevin, right? Sleep on Tatum. He has some ups. And, and I love seeing him trying to electrify the crowd. Walker against Dragic. And it's blocked. And pushing it up, here's Boston. Tatum leading the charge. How about the speed with which Tatum gets down the court? Awesome at reading the defense and then exploiting the opportunity in the open floor. Now here's Dragic. Let's it go from 14. Misses off the right iron. Kev, I know it's early, but going 0 for 4 to start a game can make a team get a little bit tight. And you always know what you're going to get from Walker Two from shots. the line. He's been a solid, consistent Elbow. free throw shooter Two. his entire career. First trip to the free throw line for him in this one. At the line for two. Shooting two. And that one falls for Walker. No question, he got bumped on that shot. The Heat shooting their first free throws of the night. Two. And the first one drops. Some changes for Boston. Cantory checked in for Daniel Tice. And Marcus Smart has subbed in for Gordon Hayward. And he makes both free throws. And we're just over three and a half minutes into the first quarter. Walker the pass to Tatum. Dishes it to Cantor. Uses the glass to finish the layup. Well, this is kind of that set play here for Cantor where he can show his wares. Good instincts there on the pick and roll. Here's Nunn. Lays it up and despite of the excellent defense at that. Here's Cantor. The shot's good on the assist by Walker. And contact on the shot, so he'll be shooting free throws here. That's on Ennis Cantor. Wow, wow, he got whacked on that one. Shouldn't be much debate there. The Heat shooting their third and fourth free throw shots of the night, and he makes the first. Our relationship started when I was in high school. He came to my morning workouts and uh, really recruited me at Butler and was kind of the first guy that I think believed in me that I could make it to the next level. And I'm sure, Greg, that relationship played a big role in Hayward deciding to join the Boston Celtics. And not just a connection, but a respect. Hayward now a veteran in this league while Stevens has moved into the conversation for one of the better young coaches in our league. And glad to have you with us as we get going here in game two. And what stands out to you guys from the heat in this one? Just stretching out the floor in that first, uh, they had the defense scrambling. Pretty prime example here of how to space the floor and do it correctly. When you do it, 
That's the kind of thing that happens. And now, brought to you by Gatorade, all fueled up and ready to go. Let's reset our lineups. And for Miami, look at who they've got out there. They've got Iguodala. Robinson is out there with Myers Leonard. Then it's Bam Adebayo. And it's none in at the point guard position. No good on that one. The Heat making a switch here. Butler's checked in. Williams, he's checked in for Boston. He hits the second from the line. And so it's Walker with it who brings it up for the Celtics. They've led by as much as 10. Outside Williams. Now Walker, he has six. Good, nice job down low. Hayward comes in for Williams. We're just over two and a half minutes into the second quarter. Miami's gone three of five from beyond the arc so far tonight and slam dunk by Butler. Yeah, and Butler is a menace to the defense partner. I, I don't think that was a petty or a Manny. That was a facial. Now here's Walker. Eight points for him. Left side Williams. Stolen by Robinson. And now running up the court. Leonard pushing it up. That's a stomach punch, guys. Mm. Turn it over and give him a free run to the bucket. Oh, you're so right. No question who has the momentum now. Execution with pace. That's a bad turnover that simply was telegraphed. For a guy who's still working on his range, love to see Smart attacking on the interior. Robinson left side. Butler against Hayward. But they'll get another chance. Passes it to Leonard. Outside Butler. That's good, and it's Leonard with the assist. It's going to be on Jay Crowder. Just such a physical player. Williams has no off switch, he is, which is how he gets these calls. First one falls for him. And both free throws good for Williams. And on top of the talent, the, the physical ability, w Williams, just a coachable kid and really picks things up quickly. Now here's Butler. Ten points for him. And that one, good. Doing a lot of nice work now from the field. He's helped get them this lead, and now he's helped them keep it. Walker the pass to Tice. One forty-six left in the first half of the game. No one covering. And 11 points for Kemba Walker. Here's Adebayo. Shot clock at five. Over Tice. Again, the Heat, good for two. Kevin, thanks. Here with Jimmy Butler. Jimmy, you have come a long way in this league. When you look at your career now versus when you came in, how different is it? Much different. Uh, I think on the floor, I'm supposed to do a lot more on both ends of the floor. And um, off the floor, I think it's still the same. People recognize my hair. The Heat shooting their seventh and eighth free throw attempts for the game right here. Two. That free throw good from Butler. You know, and, and Butler wasn't a starter until midway through his second season. But, but since then, his minutes have gone up and his productivity has gone way up. And so Butler nails both of them. Celtics trail by six. Here's Walker. Count the bucket. And he's got a free throw coming up as well. Uh, that is how he rolls. A prolific score. Walker's been calling his own number tonight. The Celtics have put up good numbers at the charity stripe, converting six of seven. That's good from Kemba Walker. Miami leading by three. And it's Trogic off the drive. It's stolen by Tice. And it's Brown that time on the assist by Walker. Walker's got his fourth assist in this one. 
And that's where Brown is at his best, a muscular beast who loves finishing strong through the contact. Now, here's Adebayo. Seven points in the game. And wrestling for it jump there, ball, but ball, no it, one it, has it. possession. We'll players. have a jump ball. And Miami has possession, and it's Jason Tatum with the foul. And uh, he's just had one attempt at the line early. That one drops. He ties it up. Some changes for Boston. Cantor comes in for Daniel Tice, and Marcus Smart is subbed in for Kemba Walker. And that drops, so they now lead by one. These things are coming together for them at a really opportune time. Coaches always talk about the first five minutes of the third quarter. They have definitely increased their energy level here. Count it, and the Celtic lead has been cut down to six. That one coming from Butler. And allowing this to go no further. He stops a 15-0 run by the Celtics. Here's Smart. Plays it up off the glass. Smart's got his second bucket of the night. And everything is dropping for them. Terrific second half run. Well, with the confidence growing, that's one thing. But they seem to be getting more intense, and that's helping the quality of their play here. Now here's Crowder. Second chance shot. That one's in there. The Boston lead is cut down to six and the bucket from Autobio. That's the kind of aggressive and assertive play they need as we get closer and closer to crunch time. Now the pass to Tatum. Shoots over Crowder. Here's Cantor. And Cantor throws it down. One of the game's very time best out, offensive rebounders. Cantor also has the wherewithal to quickly convert for the score. Timeout called the Heat. And Coach can't be happy. And, and I think I know. Celtics passing it around. And it's Brown missing. The Heat trail by five. Jones drives in. Oh, and the dunk by Jones. Okay, of course, we just got to be a little bit more alert to rotate from what's next. Okay? We're doing a lot of good things, though. Okay? Keep finishing plays. Here's Igudala. And he banks in the layup. Who refuses to let the defense get to him. Now here's Walker. Off target with his three. Well, he got off to a terrific start from the perimeter, but in the second half, he can't seem to build on that early success. Just a much smaller defender on him. He does the exact thing at the right moment, goes straight to the rim. Here's Walker after the made shot from Andre Iguodala, and he gets the bucket. Free throw good, Adebayo. Two. Both good from the line that time. Celtics have gone two of four from the field since we started the final quarter of play. Walker goes in, pass to Tice. The shot's good on the assist by Walker. Walker's got five assists in the game. They're finding lanes to the hoop now with consistency. Five buckets in a row from the paint. Now here's Butler. He feeds it to Robinson. And he lays it straight in. And the Heat lead by two. And that solid play in the paint continues here, guys. Brown outside. They get a hand on it. Stolen by Robinson. And so it's Iguodala. He'll bring it up for the Heat. Butler in the corner. And the Heat, another three. Bottom line, you need shooters on your team who can space the floor. No, there's no doubt he's a legitimate threat from downtown, and he's demonstrating that in this game. Now here's Williams. 
Pass to Brown. Over Robinson. Yep, it goes in, and the Miami lead is cut down to three on the bucket from Brown. And that's just tremendous confidence from Brown. Going up with the shot right away and giving the D no time to react. Iguodala finds Robinson. It, it really does make the game easy for your teammates when you can lead them to the rim that well with the pass. It's Brown on the wing. Here's Williams. Here's Hayward. And he battles for the ball and gets the second chance bucket. Well, he takes care of salvaging that possession for the offense by getting on the offensive glass. Here's Hero, guarded by Walker. Here's Adebayo, and it's blocked. And that's a foul called on Bam Adebayo. And that'll be his third foul so far. Remember that one, guys, a difference maker. Yeah, I'm wondering, Greg, is that the biggest shot of the game? Rare you'll see him miss such an open look. And, and Butler, no stranger to these pressure situations. A big time gamer who knows how to take over on key possession. Now, here's Walker. Brown outside. Yes, Knockdown. Bullseye. Knockdown. Man, I'll tell you Time what, out. the Time pressure out. is cranked up. Who better to call than this guy? Timeout called the Heat. They're down Mark, by two. Work. We've got 33 seconds. We've got 33 seconds left in the fourth quarter. Shots good by Hero. Remember, he played the point guard position for most of high school, so Olenek has retained that vision. Now a timeout called by Boston. They trail by one. 27 seconds left to play in the final quarter. Seven second difference, shot and game clock. Brown the pass to Tice. Agic against Walker. Back to Tice. No good. And he's easily been their best rebounder tonight. Well, he's been everywhere and collecting those rebounds, that ends any kind of offensive possession and gets them started. Th that's right. No other option but to foul and hope for some misses. There's 10 seconds left to play here in the fourth. And so they foul intentionally. First free throw is good, and that will put them up by two. So it gets them both, and it's a three-point game. That last one was a difference maker. It pushed it from a two-point lead to three. Looking to tie it up with a big triple. Well, you can bet that's what they're looking for. This late in the game, they need that three. And an intentional foul there stops the clock. That's his third personal foul. Bam, out of bio. Two. So the first one drops, and that gives them a four-point cushion. So he goes two for two at the line, and it's a five-point game. Ooh, I think that's a wrap. And I can tell you, you can't have more pressure-packed free throws than the ones that are going to seal the game. And so it's Miami winning this one. And you got to feel good about getting each and every game here in the postseason. You know, Kevin, each game is, is just so significant and, and magnified. This has got to feel really good. It's time now to go courtside as we send you over to David Aldridge from the sideline. David, take it away. Thank you, Kevin. Jimmy, you have become a star in this league, big part of the team. Have those expectations put more pressure on you individually? Uh, no, no pressure. I think I'm going a, I'm to a do what I do each and every night. I'm not going to play well every night. I just got to focus on me, this team, and worry about the outside of things. A real leader, Jimmy. Thank you for your time. Back to you, Kevin. Yeah, going to state to state, yeah. Going back to bank, yeah. Up from check the ranks, yeah. Bitch, you out of place, yeah. Yeah, uh, I don't play like Sony. I got scars like Tony. Pull away into a horse, no pony. These niggas cap, these niggas phony. I am a winner, so where's my trophy? Niggas beginners.